Why the fuck do you have a lucky rock? Good luck, rock. Hi, I'm Lucas from Clever Tele Gaming here today in Mass Effect Andromeda. Um, I got it a little bit early because of my EA Access subscription. Uh, so let's jump right in. So I guess we're in the 2700s now. Actually, we'd be in the 2800s based on math. Oh god, what shot you out? We made it. Deep breaths. You're going to want to take it easy. Especially if taking it easy like for that. 600 years. Rider, recon specialist, Pathfinder mission team. Pathfinder team, eh? The ones finding us a home. Can you make it somewhere tropical? Nice warm ocean, summer year round. How about we get her a cup of coffee first? Man. That's one ugly motherfucker. The selection process saw the Andromeda Initiative evaluate thousands of potential habitable planets within the galaxy. Ryder, let's get you checked out. God, look I have here. to look at this face. After discovering an unusually high ratio of potential How long are we going to have to look at this space? Worlds, the Helios Cluster was selected as our destination. Now you are a part of the first wave of arcs arriving in Andromeda, our new home for humanity. Makes it sound so easy, doesn't it? I hope not. I signed up for a little adventure before we settle down. Well, buckle up. Sounds like you'll get your wish. Yeah? Over here now, the Pathfinder wants you all on your feet right away. He said mission ready within the hour. Any idea why? No, but I'm guessing that's where your adventure comes in. What's going on with those eyes? Okay, everything checks out. Just one more thing before I send you on your way. Let's test your salmon plant. Are my eyes sticking Sam, through my eyelids? Are you Sam, are you online? Yes, Dr. Taparo. Good morning, Ryder. Are you feeling well? I feel like a 600-year-old popsicle. I hope we pack more coffee. Readings confirmed. Based on the levels of adenosine in your system, the neural implant is functioning properly. Wait, adeno what? It just means you're still shaking off your nap. No reason why we can't get you on your way. Though you may want to hang around while we revive your brother. It always helps to see a familiar face. I don't like the sound of that. He's an ugly motherfucker too. Just you wait. Ouchies. Yeah, you know, that's not good for a ship. I don't know a lot about space travel. But I can tell that that is not good for... The ship. Watch the What's happening? It broke free. Just hang on. Engineering, report. 
zero gravity. Gravity cloud offline. I'm almost inside. Hold on. This is Cora. I'm at the cryo bay. Brace for a reset. Everyone okay? I think so. What happened? We're not sure. Sensors are scrambled. But it's good to see you're up. Feels like centuries since we spoke. This oh, you're smooth. Island. Mission teams continue preparations. Cora, riders, report to the bridge. You heard him. Let's get. Uh, we have a problem over here. It's no, brother. What's wrong? I don't know. Ryder, is my brother okay? Is he gonna make it? Scott's fine. His vitals are strong, but the revival procedure was interrupted. I don't like the sound of that. Don't worry. It just means the process could take a bit longer than usual. Sam? My connection to Scott's implant was suspended. However, his pulse, respiration, and brain activity are all normal. To be on the safe side, we need to keep him in a low level dead. for a while. Then let his body regain consciousness naturally. He'll be fine. Glad to hear it. Thanks, Lexi. You keep us updated. He's dead. I'll be at the door whenever you're ready to go. Uh. Gravity loss means something tripped the generators. Like what? You ready? What's wrong? Oh. Explodey. A little explodey. Hey, up here. Yeah, I'm looking at you. Whatever hit the arc fried everything. We have to balance the power loader, it could explode. But we don't know where the fault is. Alright. Ryder could find it. She has a scanner. Quick Ryder, use it to locate the fault. Hmm, convenient. I'll try to get rid of Oh, very convenient. <laughs> hey, get on this one. I'll override the statement. It's operating normally. Got it. It has to be here. There's no indication. Relay 2C shows damage from a temperature spike. Found it! Bad relay! Okay. Ryder, can you go reset it? Take the scanner first, that'd probably help. Oh, overriding. Overriding there. relay. It's reset! God. I can't look at my face. It's just so bad. Good job, Ryder. Now we can get to the tram. Helm control, report. We're drifting. Flight controls aren't responding. First priority is stopping these outages. Mainline power's been knocked out. We're on reserves, Captain. They won't last. What's our position? Unknown. We lost telemetry. Sam, we need eyes out there. Attempting to adjust sensor array. Alec, please. You may be Pathfinder, but this is my ship. Captain, the protocol's clear. In the absence of communication with the Nexus or the other arcs, we proceed to our appointed golden world. Solid ground. If it's even out there. Hmm. Nobody said anything about running into an energy cloud. And that's just a wild guess what we hit. Weird. He's got my eyes. Purple and red. He's Alec, a lot prettier though. The damage. Tell that. Stop the bleeding. We've got twenty thousand people asleep on this ship. Let's give them a chance. God. Can you blame her? Oh, good lord. Oh. Your father's got a point face. though. Solid ground sounding pretty good right now. Yeah, but. Pretty good. Isn't good enough. Yes, sir. We're coming through. My God. Is that our golden world? This was not in the brochures. That's Habitat 7. New Earth, if we're lucky. <laughs> All of our long-range scans told us it was in the green zone. Why did I do this to myself? Perfect for human settlement. Hmm. Doesn't even look the same. 
We don't know how bad it is yet. It still seems like it's our best shot. Maybe. There's just a what did I do to this face? Sam? The energy from the phenomenon is dumping our senses. Planetary conditions are unknown. It's got all the face parts it needs. It's just not, room, not... 20,000 souls adrift It's not put together right. And when the power runs out... Oh god, out, the nose! ...stays out... We need to know if that's safe harbor. <laughs> and if it's not... As Pathfinder, it'll be my job to find an alternative. It's what we trained for. <sighs> but if this goes well... We are already... I have actual home. chills looking at my own face. This is not... This is not All good. right, just make it quick. Harper, the rest of the team should be awake by now. Have them spin up two shuttles. Planet fallen Shivering third. in anticipation. Yes, sir. Sh sorry. Shuddering in anticipation. A stubborn one, isn't he? Uh, he takes after me. Stubborn runs in the family. Guess I rubbed oh. off on him. Just as long as he knows what he's doing. It's not like the cavalry's coming to save the day. I need an ETA on our sensor repairs. I mean, I'm fine You're to wait 600 years for backup. I mean, I don't, I don't know what your problem is. It's like a lifespan or something? Or weirdos. Hmm. I wonder if the Asari on this ship were awake the whole time, because they live for like a thousand years. Hmm. My brother's going to hate that he missed this. Are all the riders adrenaline junkies? Yes. I guess it's in our blood. I was born a minute ahead of him. I never let him forget it. Don't worry. I'm sure Scott will pull through. Yeah, and when he does, he'll want to hear stories. So, let's get out there and find him one. Yeah. Right. You'll want to get your helmet. Oh, okay. And maybe stop at the good luck rock before we go. The, the what? It's an old super Got it. That should do it. The Pathfinder. Dad's rock. Why the fuck do you have a lucky rock? Good luck, rock, huh? Your dad was mountain climbing back on Earth. It caught him from falling. The way things are going today, we'll need any luck. What a we superstitious dickbag. Yeah. You. It's a 634 year journey, and you brought a rock. You brought a rock. Everything was in the clear. How could things change like that? God. What a dumbass. I hate my game, Dad. Dr. Carlisle, with everything going on, I think the Ark needs you more than we do. Pathfinder wants a medic on hand. And if that is home down there, I'm happy to knock on the door. It's what we hope it is. It'll be one for the history books. You got a quote ready? One small step. I'm pretty sure your dad will handle that honor. All right, team, button it up. We leave in five. Mm, what Sir, should I say when I land on the planet? We weapons as requested. Anything we should know about? Seem prudent, given the Write situation. Write your predictions in the comments. We'll be down a man with Scott out. I heard what happened. Your brother's strong. He'll make it. Scott wouldn't want us to worry because of him. You're right. The mission comes first. Though... I doubt your mother would have seen it that way. I promised her I'd get you two here safely. Okay, team, listen up. I chose each of you for the Pathfinder team, not just because you're talented and passionate, but because you're dreamers, like me. We dream of exploring the unknown, of finding the edge of the map, and then discovering what lies beyond. When people look back on this, and they will, they'll remember we didn't give up. That we kept dreaming that our first few faltering steps in Andromeda were the beginning of everything they know. We only get one chance to be first. So, let's go make history. You got it, Dad! Your rock isn't stupid at all. Six hundred years for this. I promise. Ah. <sighs>
switching to manual guidance. Shuttle 2, taking your lead. Oh, oh, nice, easy, mind. straightforward mission. This is gonna be great. We just gotta check out the landscape. No problem. Alright guys, this is where I'm going to end this video. Um, please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. Uh, part 2 should be out soon. And I hope to see you guys next time. Bye!